Every day. Hey, honey, what's up? Where are you? Uh, who is that guy, and how did I miss him? Uh, upstairs. Uh, I'm, uh, just like. You sound weird. Are you okay? I do feel very strange right now. Not myself at all. I'm gonna go find Marco. Dad. What is it, honey? I'm so confused. I don't think I can go through with this wedding. Just that mom said that he would never be faithful to me. And then Debbie said the way I could find that if he wouldn't be is if he confessed to kissing Noel last night. Because that would mean that he's sorry. And he didn't. And I think that it speaks to a larger character flaw. And on top of it all, he, he, can't, even, he can't even tell me how he feels about me. Honey, honey, listen. People are human. They make mistakes. I made a lot of mistakes with your mom. And she definitely punished me for it. But I never stopped loving her. I need it. Acid seizure? I guess all the lawyers in the world weren't able to change the way I feel about her. So why did you cheat on her? Because <sighs> I was selfish. And lonely and insecure. Your mom's a real star, honey. When she blew out her knee, I wasn't sad. I was thrilled. I thought, finally, I don't have to share her with the rest of the world. Yeah, but that didn't happen. She went right back to work and became the star choreographer. The one everyone wanted to work with and everyone adored. And there I was, still nobody, holding her coat at parties. Dad, I had no idea. What I did to her was the biggest mistake of my life. I think I must have always hoped for a second chance. But I never thought I'd get it. I never felt I deserved it. After you cheated on mom, she couldn't trust you anymore. And now I know why. I can't trust Marco. No, he loves you, honey. Really? Where's the proof? Talk to me anymore. I can't go through with this wedding. I'm going home. Mirabella. <laughs>